drivers behind the line. I want everybody to count this one down with me now, okay? Three. And right off the bat, we see the Blue Alliance first fire. They get four of their cargo into the upper hub, and that is evenly matched by four more from Red. The Red Alliance not done yet with their autonomous scoring. Madtown Robotics putting two more in for the Red Alliance. Warrior Borgs, however, likewise launching two more for Blue. That means we start Tally Up with a perfectly tied match. Red Alliance, however, quick to pull ahead with both Madtown and Red shooting into the upper hub. And both those robots, for the moment undefended, able to quickly pick up the cargo they have just scored and launch them again for another two points each. And that means the Red Alliance is starting to pull ahead and score. Robodors starting to add some upper hub scoring for blue. Warrior Borgs as well. But that is matched by a twin volley from the Red Alliance. And Madtown adding two more of their own. Red Alliance pulling ahead by even slightly more in this match. And the Blue Alliance sees from Warrior Borgs two cargo into the upper hub. From Robodors, one. There are other bouncing out. Madtown once again, though, matching that with two of their own. Madtown finding themselves with the whole side of the field to themselves, picking up any red cargo that come their way. And with 70 seconds to go, we have about 30 points separating our alliances. Red Alliance is raging sea biscuits. What they find themselves doing, both making it difficult for the Robodos to score and playing some interference to leave their alliance partners plenty of room, which Madtown is the first to take advantage of. And with 50 seconds to go, Madtown, although they find two robots in front of them, they are able to shoot over their heads straight to the upper hub, adding to the Red Alliance's score. Red, much like the second match, they have been steadily scoring for the Red Alliance as well. And although Warrior Borgs are able to score two more for blue. Robodores have found themselves effectively neutralized by the defense, unable to match the Red Alliance's rate of scoring. And with 20 seconds to go, all eyes still on the hub. Warrior Borgs facing Red Robots on either side, finding it difficult to get lined up and take their shots. One of them makes its mark, however, including two more from the Robodores, but the Red Alliance has the lead, and with 10 seconds left, your results for that tiebreaker match. The winner is the Red Alliance. That means that